I'm Ali Panahande and I'm from Iran. I'm 15. In this video, I'm going to talk about some of the things that I did. Uh, I'm going to talk about myself, who I am, and my program, the algorithms that I used, and what I've learned from CoSpace Icle Challenge. So let's start, shall we? Okay. I'm Ali Panahande. I'm 15 and from Iran. I'm participating in the U19 category. It's been about four years since I started programming. I'm really into programming and subjects connected with it. I've had some achievements in programming. For example, there was a competition called Iran Open, in which I got into the second place. And once, and once I got a 100% ITD degree in C programming language. What I've learned from iCall Challenge. There are a lot of things that I've learned from iCall Challenge since it was my first international challenge. First things first, teamwork, even in hard situations and tight deadlines. Second, new strategies and new ways of problem solving. I've learned some new strategies while watching others games. In my opinion, one of the participants who completed the challenge in a really good way was SG5019 from um, Singapore. Game search. When I wrote the basics of my program, I thought about making a searching algorithm in which the robot searches for objects in the map, not randomly. To do this, I use a routing algorithm. For, for going from a place to another, I use a right angle triangle with the help of arctangent and Pythagorean theorem. In this way, I could give n places in my program and take the robot from a place to another. I divide the map into different zones. When the super object is made, the robot goes for the super object and takes it. How it's done is simple. The robot changes radian to a compass and goes to the zone where the super object is made in and takes it. Another algorithm that I used in my program, I had, a time, I had a time function in my program. If a fixed or moving wall in front of the robot, the robot didn't go to the next zone, and what it did was that it went to the zone that there, weren't, there wasn't any wall in. We're doing this as an intersect function and a boolean function that if two segments cut to each other off, the out will be returned false. So this is the video of my match. Um, let's watch it together and see what I've done, shall we? Okay. 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 CN7010 takes the super object. Nice. Five minutes remaining. Okay, yeah, here. I go for the super object. Yeah, and okay. Okay, the blue robot takes the super object. Nice. Real nice.
I don't know what's happening, like there's a kind of a problem with the robot, it's just... What? Oh, okay, no. E and mine, I have a problem too. Okay, done, yeah. Nice! Okay, blue robot is now one one thousand twenty hundred and sixty points. I'm now one thousand and fifty. So I've been frozen. No, the blue robot is being frozen. Oh, okay. Okay, depositing. The blue robot is depositing. Nice. 1,730. Okay, the blue robot takes the super object. Nice. Real nice. About two minutes remaining. Okay, I'm depositing. Thank God. One thousand four hundred seventy one thousand nine hundred seventy five. Real nice. Um, okay. I'm going there. So, like, my robot is taking the super object, and the blue robot is depositing. Wow! 2260. Real nice. Really good. Awesome. Okay. It's taking the super object. Plus 180. Now I'm going there. Um, okay. And some plant. Okay. Fifty seconds remaining time. Okay, 15 seconds. Die match, isn't it? Okay. The match has ended. Congratulations to, um, let me see, to CN7010 for winning this match. Great, so yeah, this was my video, I hope you liked it, and thank you for watching this. Goodbye.